following your work now. You have? Yes, I have. I ever since Complex, I've been following your work. So we got the Prince of LA. I gotta say the Prince of Long Beach, you kinda are, like, cause your dad is Snoop Dogg, man. How has it been carrying that title around all your life? Cause I know people say it to you. Uh, you just gotta have a mentality of a prince and you'll be good. I think just knowing like, what's that stake? You know, I don't ever want to embarrass my family cause you know, we have a, a powerful name and just want to keep that legacy continuing. Now, you were playing football, you were a talented athlete, and then you switched it up and started doing the film. What made you just say, okay, I'm gonna pursue my dreams and really do this and leave that alone? Cause you are a really good athlete. I took football as far as I wanted to take it. I didn't see myself going to the NFL. I always had, you know, big dreams of making movies and commercials. So I decided, you know, once I got to UCLA, I was like, I wanna change my career. I wanna do film. I wanna explore, you know, and adventure into other things. Now, who are some of the people that you've had a chance to work with since you've been doing your film work? Has your dad let you shoot anything yet with him? Yeah, we shot a movie for him. Um, we're working with some athletes right now. Uh, John Ross III, we're doing a commercial. Uh, we talking with Sports Illustrated and Xbox with it, um, thinking about selling it to them. Uh, we got a lot of stuff coming up, so just be on the lookout for Film School Productions. Now, what advice would you give to young people who are kind of stuck being an athlete or are stuck doing one thing and they're afraid to step out and try faith and do pursue their dream? I would just tell them straight up, don't wait. You know what I mean? I waited year after year till I was 19, 18 to switch careers. If I would have got started young, I would have probably had like five movies right now. But really, just, just don't wait. Um, Follow your heart. Do what makes you happy because at the end of the day, that's all you have is your happiness. Now tell me, why was it important for you to be a part of the Know Your Status Tour? It was important because it's a positive movement and uh, I want to use my, my, my following and I want to empower them. I want to let them know about everything, not just sexual health, but I want them to know to dream big, to you know, believe in yourself and just do something positive with, with your following. All right, awesome, man. I definitely want to get a quick picture with you.